been talking about Google, I thought I should bring out a Googler hat. I'm a Googler? This is what we make people wear on their first day at Google, and then you gotta run around the stage and make the fan go round and round. <laughs> we'll swear you that. Man, I tell you what, day one, you're harassing me. All right. <laughs> But like thanks, for, thanks for all the partnership. It's very yeah. exciting to be here. Great set of announcements. Yeah, and I just, so let's start with talking about Android. You're now responsible. Congratulations. You have a broader responsibility. Why don't you talk to us a little bit about Android and how that's going? Look, man, I've talked about this at uh, our developer conference as well. Uh, for us, both Android and Chrome uh, represent two large platforms, two open platforms, designed from the ground up so that developers like you, partners like you, can work on top of it. And we are seeing amazing momentum across both platforms. On Android, we just announced uh, we have hit over 1 billion device activations uh, globally. So the momentum is great. We are working hard on our upcoming release. It's called KitKat. And uh, we activate more than 1.5 million devices every single day. And if you look at Android, it's not just an operating system. It's an ecosystem. Google Play has over 50 billion apps that have been downloaded. So the momentum across the ecosystem is uh, amazing to see. You know, uh, it was on this exact stage two years ago that Intel and Google stood up and talked about what we're going to do with Android and bringing devices to market. Yeah. I mean, to me, to see Android phones and tablets based on Intel architecture is exceptionally exciting. I think the combination of higher performance for low power, that trade-off, I think adds a whole new dimension onto the devices out there and we hope it drives a whole set of new adoption. Yeah, you know, and so I just got that announcing these wonderful new Chromebooks are coming for holiday. We've been working with you since day well, one on this. Why don't we talk about a little bit of things we're doing there? Look, for us, Chrome OS represents a new form of computing. Uh, we are seeing great momentum there as well. Uh, by external analyst estimates, they already represent over 25% of the sub-$300 category. Uh, they're big in education as well. They're now deployed in over 5,000 schools in the U.S. Uh, represents more than 20% of the school districts. Uh, just before I walked in here, I checked. Uh, they've been number one on the best-selling laptop on Amazon uh, for well over a year. In fact, the number two selling laptop on Amazon is a Chromebook as well. I'm excited about the new set of devices. Haswell, to me, you get great performance with all-day battery life, 9 to 10 hours on all the devices we talked about today. And at the price points they're going to come in, I think they'll be hugely disruptive in the market and as a tipping point. Uh, it's fantastic, and we really appreciate the work we've done together. Yeah, great. So and what about the future? Where do you see us going together? Look, you talked about you investing over 1,000 engineers. That's a huge commitment from Intel's side. We're very appreciative. We from Google are very committed to making sure Android and Chrome work great on top of uh, Intel's architecture. I want to thank all of you as well, the huge developer community, for working on top of our platforms. And I want to thank the OEM partners, Acer, HP, Toshiba, and Asus, who are announcing devices today. I think we're going to do a lot more. Excited. All right. Well, it's great to see you. Thanks, Dad. Thanks, Dad. Thanks.